Hello YouTubers, this is Fedor. Just wanted to make a quick video about the uh, 8-bit shift, right? shift register 74HC595. And the cool thing about this little chip is it uses three, um, three pins from the Arduino over here to control eight different outputs of the LEDs. And um, here's a little pinout of the chip. So pin 16 is positive, pin 15 is LED LED 0, uh, pin 1 is LED 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, pin 8 is ground, pin 9 is a serial out, that's if you want to cascade, have uh, more than one of these chips, like connect them together, so you would go pin 9 from this chip into a clock pin, pin 11 of the one next to it, and you can have many of them, and, it, and you can control, and you can use three wires to control 16 or 24, uh, outputs or in this case would be LEDs so uh, pin 10 is the uh, master reset that's uh, you apply low voltage to 10 and it resets the chip and then starts over so I, I, keep, I kept it positive in this circuit so I have pin 10 over here connected to positive it's kinda hard to see but the green wire behind there 11 is a clock pin uh, pin 12 is a latch Pin 13 is the output enable, so you keep that negative um, and it enables the output. If you keep it positive, it stops the output. And then 14 is data, and then 15, you know, LED 0. And um, here's the code for it. Let's see. Okay, so pin 1 is LED 1, pin 2, LED 2, 3, 4, 5, pin 7 is 7, pin 8 is negative or ground. Um, Pin 9 is not used, that's serial out, you just leave it blank, don't do nothing with it. Uh, pin 10 is the master reset, so you keep that positive in your circuit. Um, I'll make it negative to reset, but uh, uh, pull it up to positive. Pin 11 is the uh, SHCP, or the clock. Pin 12 is the STCP, or the latch, I call it a latch. Pin 13 is the output enable, so in this circuit it's, it's negative to enable output positive to stop the output. Pin 14 is the data pin, DS. And then pin 15 is the LED 0. And then pin 16 is the positive. And here's the declared. So you connect pin 12 of the 74HC595 chip to Arduino pin 10. And this is the latch pin. And then pin 11 from the 74 um, HC595 pin to pin 11 of the uh, Arduino, which that's, that's the clock pin, and then the data pin, pin 14 from the chip to pin 12, and then declare a variable for time. And here's the here's the setup. So all three of these are outputs. And then here's the loop, and it's super easy to use this. So first you have to make the uh, latch pin low, so digital right latch pin to be low and then shift out command. That's pretty cool. Arduino has this little built-in thing. So you put the data pin first, clock pin, and then the uh, this is a least significant byte first, or you can do most significant. I have it commented out over here. But if you do most significant byte first, it would display it uh, backwards. So it would, see right here, I have uh, first three LEDs to be off, Second, and then the next two are on and then off and then on and then off. So, by doing first significant first, it would display these uh, from from right to left instead of left to right. And then you would a latch pin goes high, and then that displays the that um, displays the outputs. So here it is. The first one is the one two pin LED three and four are on, and LED six is on. And on the second one, uh, first four first four LEDs are on, and then LED six is on. And here it is. So first four LEDs are on, and then LED six is on. And for the first one, we have the LED three and four on. Three and four, and then LED six is on also. LED LED six is on also. And you can change these out. You can make them all ones. So I'm going to change those three zeros to one, two, three, and then I'll take make I'll make that LED low, 
and the very last one I'll change it to one, to one and then when you upload it, it takes a second to upload and then done uploading and we check it out and the LEDs just like we programmed them um, first for on then this one's off and then the second one it's on and then this one's off all the time and then that one's on all the time and then those are off so there it is just like we have it the binary digits first four are on two off and then one on and then last one's off and on this one only one of them is off while everything else is on and all the loop does is just loops through this loops does this one first and then does this one does that one loop it just loops forever 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 till Arduino loses power is turned off and that is all for now if you have any comments or questions or you want to copy of this code uh, message me and I'll and I'll see what I can do thank you